Welcome back to Four Swords Adventures. This is the first stage of the first world. If you learned anything about me in the last playthrough, you will learn that I am horrible at math. Hey, get up, Link. Basically every Zelda game ever, Link is always asleep. God, he looks, like, creepy, kind of. Like, why does his... Why does his head do that? It looks like he has a mustache or something. Like, he, he doesn't... He's just... No. Quit it. So, yeah, you have to... Oh, God. No, stop. So, you have to infuse your sword with Force Gems. Basically, in every level, you have to collect 2,000 Force Gems. Hey, asshole. Stuff. You found a force gem. Can you imagine if I told you that every time? How obnoxious that would be. I really, really, really wanted to like Triforce Heroes. Um, because it's kind of like a spiritual successor to this game. But I just the way they handled the like formations and like the tediousness of the fucking like moving links around, it's just like a total buzz kill. Cause I thought for sure it, I I just assumed it'd be like this. But no. Oh my god, I get it. This game definitely tugs at the Link to the Past nostalgia strings for sure. If you actually have a Game Boy SP, it'll uh, show this on that screen. But if you're like 80% of the population that, you know, doesn't have a Game Boy SP, the screen works just fine. Game, we had to carry the keys around. Great talk.
Yeah, it's pretty easy to find force gems. They're kind of everywhere. Oh, and then he's gone. Oh wait, maybe you only have to get 1,000, I forget. You've always been a real and true fairy. Yeah, Tingle will show up to troll you basically throughout the entire game if there's ever a large force jam. There's a sign in the past that says that. So you get all that shit in the water too.
Yeah, that's what Triforce Heroes needs right there. The ability to, the, the ability to do exactly that. on the other side. swung the bush. Well, either way. Get out of here. What? Do you really? Really? We did it. We beat the first stage. And wow, that was a long video. I feel like most of the levels aren't actually that long. But we'll see. You know, we will see. Next time, we are going to be getting into, um, well, I'll tell you so you can show us here, because I'm not sure. Oh, wow, okay. The name of the stage is at the top, okay. I thought Lake Hylia was the world, whereabouts of the wind was the level. Okay, so this would be the Cave of No Return in our next section.